just give me a kind of a timeline who were the razakars when did when was it formed why was it formed and when was it disbanded in 1946 a person called qasim razvi hmm. who came from marathwada region who was a lawyer who was in hyderabad took over the charge of mim or majlis e ittehadul muslimin even at that time it was called majlis e ittehadul muslimin uh the name was changed after nine, in 1956 or so to all yeah. india majlis e ittehadul muslimin and that was accepted it was a political party then too it was a political party under the guise of a social organization okay. because during the nizam's time there was no reason to have a political party except nizam's will to huh. so, in 1946 two things were happening at the same time hmm. one is that the pressure from delhi was increasing ke you have to take a call either you are with us or you have to make a settlement ये दिल्ली से इनका जो कांग्रेस थी उसके साथ में जो कम्युनिकेशन था जो प्रिंसली स्टेट्स मर्ज हो रही थी हाँ 600 के करीब में प्रिंसली स्टेट्स थे जिसमें सबसे बड़ा जो था वो हैदराबाद था और सबसे ज्यादा जो रिश था वो भी हैदराबाद था और इसका जो एरिया था वो भी सबसे ज्यादा था तो इट वॉज अस प्राइज दिस थिंग तो निज़ाम जो थे उस जमाने में उस्मान अली खान ही वॉज नॉट श्योर and he was under pressure from various quarters mm. and he was having dreams of keeping his domain as independent magar 1946 mein bhi unka ye khayal tha ke mujhe azadi dijiye because in 1980 1857 i had become part of the crown and the crown was recognizing me ha to that will continue but there were three powers which were not with me at that time the military and uh, aviation mm-hmm. and one more uh, postal service mm-hmm. so this was denied to him he said no this is not going to happen we have to talk to you 47 happened mm-hmm. in 47 again the indian government wait uh, let me take you back a little bit didn't jinnah saab ask the nizam to come with him that was happening hmm. but there was that was a very bad episode with jina kya hua jina came to hyderabad hmm. and he sat with uh, usman ali khan hmm. with his legs folded on each side and he took out a cigar and uh, lit it huh. the nizam said the meeting is over you can go tehzeeb nahi hai out with you Boy, Seriously? Boy, no, this has happened. This is a recorded event. I'm not talking about anything which is My not there. My goodness. What are you saying? Yes. Yes. They said that this broke away their relationship. That there. was it, huh? Ah. And he... Do you you think, don't treat a Raja like this. But do you think he did it purposely, Jinnah? I don't think. He was not aware of Jinnah's eccentricities, Jinnah's ah. self-belief that how important he is. Because at one time, ah. he was... token he was being talked to as he was the caliph of the muslims across the world uh. and he had the connections with the turkish princess he had married abdul majid's daughter dure shahwar uh. and uh, got it married to his aur phir ye samne baith ke ab ye samne baith ke kaun hai wo who is he जिना के साथ तो उनकी बातचीत टूट गई मगर वो प्रपोजल जो पाकिस्तान के साथ जाना था वो जिंदा रहा मगर ही डिड नॉट गिव हिज ओपिनियन ऑन वेदर आई गो विद पाकिस्तान ही क्लियरली सेट ऑन सेवरल ओकेजन दैट आई विल रिमेन इंडिपेंडेंट ऑफ बोथ ऑफ यू एंड ही वॉन्टेड टू सी हाउ थिंग्स मूव आफ्टर दैट एंड देन वी विल डिसाइड तो कितनी देर तक ये चलता रहा फ्रॉम नाइनटीन फोर्टी सेवन टू नाइनटीन फोर्टी एट Where the Indian Army decided enough is enough. Operation Polo. Operation Polo was carried out in the name of something very, very polite, police action. So they called it police action, but they brought in the military and the air force and attacked Hyderabad from five corners, hmm. and they came in, 
and they took over in five days. The entire thing was over. It started on September 13 and ended on September 17. So, where were the Razakars at this period? They were in Hyderabad. The Razakars were the only people who tried to put up a, a resistance. But who created and why was it created? Now, Razakars had been created as a voluntary force. And there were thousands and thousands of them. The exact figure we do not have. Razakars were the volunteers hmm. who have been behaving as the rulers. Hmm. And they were going to villages, hmm. attacking people, hmm. behaving this thing. But uh, this Razakar movement and then simultaneously there was a communist armed struggle. Hmm. It is called Telangana Armed Struggle. वो वरंगल वरंगल के करीब में और खम्मम ये दो जो जो डिस्ट्रिक्स हैं वहाँ पे लोग ज़्यादा एक्टिव थे तो ये दोनों चीजें एक साथ चल रही थीं आपके पास में एक कम्युनिस्ट मूवमेंट आम डिस्ट्रगल और एक रजाकार रजाकार वर सपोज टू काउंटर द कम्युनिस्ट कम्युनिस्ट बट रजाकार्स वर हायर्ड बाय द जमीन Reddies and Brahmins and all that. Hmm. They were hired to protect their land from these kind of people, hmm. communists. So that was going on at that time. Hmm. And uh, Razakars played a very crucial role hmm. in that. Click here to watch the full episode.